Greetings After Effectsers, let's take a look at using After Effects Lights to create a shadow on some text. Okay, so we've got this going on. Be nice and simple. So how do we do that? Well, let's start a new composition. I'm going to call this Shadows. Okay, and I'm going to do a new background layer. So I'll do a new solid. I'll call this background. This colour's fine. And make that 3D. And make some new text. Shadows. Let's align that using the align menu to the centre. And also make that 3D. Okay, so we're ready to rock. Let's add a new light to this. I'll choose a simple point light. Okay, and to cast shadows, I need to do two things. First, I need to turn the shadows on for the text. So I'm going to open up the text options, material options, cast shadows, I'm going to turn to on. Okay, but we've got no shadows yet, and we can see why if we take a look in our custom view. So I'll switch to my custom view. There we go. And of course, the text and the background are in the same place. So if I pull the text forward, I get shadows. And if I move the light, I can control the kind of size of those shadows. Okay, so that's pretty good. Now, if I go back to my active camera, we can see that the shadow is very dark with a hard edge. I want to make it look a little more realistic. So we'll open up our light options. Okay, and I'll take the shadow darkness maybe down to 50. And the shadow diffusion, maybe 30. Okay, so we get a, a softer, more transparent shadow. Okay, there we go. So now I can take this light and I can move the position over. All the way over to the left. Hit P, add a position keyframe. Move forward on the timeline. Bring my light over to the other side. Got a new keyframe. I might select those keyframes and easy ease them. Always nice. And I've got a nice simple animation with the light passing across there. Just turn the resolution down to play faster. There we go. So we got that. And what you could also do, if you're feeling fancy, is we could add a little bit of a kind of strobe effect to the light. If I go to the intensity, alt click on that, type in wiggle, let's say 20 by 30. So 20 times per second, it's gonna change value by up to 30. Oops, sorry, that's a comma, press the wrong button. There we go, wiggle 20, 30. We'll get ourselves a kind of strobe light effect. Okay, so very simple use of lights in After Effects. Thank you.